Hi everybody, it's Amy from Bargain Beauty and I'm here to share with you what I got at Aldi. Please make sure to subscribe if you haven't already. Thank you so much for clicking on my video. And if you don't enjoy birds, you might want to click out of this video because I am home. And when I am home and I film, you will hear the birds in the background. So if you would like to see what I got at Aldi today, please make sure to stick around. So the first item that I got were the Romaine Hearts. They're $2.29. I do know there was a recall on the Romaine, but in my Aldi there was a sign that stated they were perfectly safe. They are not part of the recall. So they are $2.29. The next item I picked up were the pita bread, and I absolutely, they're not actually bread, they're just pita, right? But I actually like these from time to time instead of bread, and these were $1.49. The sour cream, which is 16 ounces, is $1.49. The peppers, there's a three count. I actually used one last night for dinner. They are $1.69. The cucumber bags, the little mini bags, the little mini cucumbers that come in the bags, excuse me, I picked up two of these. They're $1.99. I like to get them at Aldi because they are a lot cheaper than Stop and Shop. At Stop and Shop, they're $3.99. So for that price, I can actually get two bags at Aldi as opposed to getting one bag. I did get the Countryside Creamery Butter Salted. You get four sticks, it's $2.36. I got a whole container, two pounds of the kiwi at $3.99. At Stop and Shop, these were $5, so you're saving a dollar and one cent. I did get 40 bags of the black garbage bags. These are the flap tie bags. You can get 28 bags with the drawstring for the same exact price, but because of what I'm using it for, I don't really need the drawstring, so I just grabbed the quantity that was more to my need for that price, if that makes sense. So I needed more bags. I didn't need them to be able to be drawstring, so I chose to get the larger size for $4.59. Now this brand is an Aldi brand that they have all the time. They work. They either manufacture this or they work with this manufacturer because it is all over the store. I absolutely love it. If you guys know if this is specifically an Aldi brand, let me know in the comment section. So the rectangular carrier is $3.99. It is a very large size. I'm super excited about that. I'm actually going to take all of this produce and stuff out of the bags. I can't stand all those bags in my refrigerator. And I'm going to put it all inside of this container. It keeps it nice and clean and neat in my fridge. I really don't use things when I put them in the drawer. So this is kind of a mind game that I'm going to play with myself to make sure that I pull this out and make sure I use everything that I purchase. I did get the round container as well. I'm actually going to make salads in this, like a big, huge salad um, every single week at the beginning of the week and keep it in the fridge. That way I'm grabbing salad instead of junk food. You know, just little bits help here and there. Now they did have a very large very nice salad bowl um, specifically for that purpose but I actually preferred this because I can fit it right inside the fridge the other one is more like if you're gonna go to a picnic or you know that kind of thing uh, it will be very very nice it'll look pretty but it would have been too tall for my refrigerator I did grab the colander set and it was $4.99 I do like this. I'm going to use the small one inside the red one for my fish tank, my little beta fish tank, to clean out the rocks. And then if I'm having just, you know, a little bit of pasta or what have you, I can use the middle one. If I'm having a larger family dinner, I can use the the green one, the largest one, um, for that. So I like having the different sizes. I like that they nest inside together. I'm going to actually donate the ones that I currently have. And then I got the Roma tomatoes, $1.39. Now, I'm not, there's no preference to Roma tomatoes, but they were the least expensive at my store at $1.39, so that's why I grabbed them. And then I did get a bag of the carrots at 99 cents. The asparagus is a really good deal, I think, for the amount that you're getting. It's $2.99. They did have smaller amount um, of the asparagus, but I thought it was kind of expensive for how much you got. It was just kind of a weird, fluky thing. So I did grab some asparagus. I also grabbed, and I'm moving my office chair, sorry guys. I did grab celery for $1.29. Dole was the only one that they did have in stock at the time. I have to be honest, it looks like I got a lot of produce, but overall in the store, it was kind of bare. 
And then I did get, and I'm not saying I'm like the most, how do I want to put it? I'm not a huge, huge, huge fan, like I gotta have this, but being that it's just me, I don't really want to make a whole thing of potato salad or a whole thing of macaroni salad, but you know, it is starting to become warmer weather, summer is coming, and I do want like a little bit, I like this container that it's easy to put back in the fridge, so the potato salad is $2.79, I do prefer it with um, the mustard and the egg and that type of thing, and then the macaroni salad, same exact price. Like I said, it's of course better homemade, but I'll doctor it up a little bit to my liking and it'll make it so much better. It's super easy and convenient when you're single. Now, I actually have this out in my car, but I'm going to return it. Not because it's not amazing, because it is probably the nicest um, sunshade I've ever purchased, but I didn't realize, see how it says jumbo? I didn't realize it was jumbo, so it doesn't fit in my car. If you're a van lifer, I don't think any van lifers watch me. The birds are really going crazy, huh? Um, this would be amazing in van life. It is thick. It is like high quality, and it was only $3.99, which was a killer deal. And then I did purchase this. I absolutely am going to use this for makeup storage, and I've decided that anything does, that does not fit inside of this container for makeup, I am going to donate. I feel like this is plenty of makeup storage, and I don't think I need much more. It was originally $8.99, and it clearanced out or on sale. They don't really have sales at Aldi, but it was $6.29. So I love that it has the big drawer on the bottom, and I, let me move this. Hold on one second. Let me show you guys. These drawers are long. It's a nice size drawer. I don't know if showing it like this on camera, it shows that. But, I mean, I'm going to be able to fit a lot of stuff in here for $6.29. That's crazy to me. Even my eyeliners will fit. So, I'm super excited about that. Um, and I'm going to put all of my larger palettes on the bottom. It does have little dividers on the bottom, but I really don't need the dividers. I actually will leave those to the side in case I ever change my mind and use this for a different purpose. You know, definitely could be used for crafting or what have you. I am going to go back to Aldi because the amount of new stuff they had, it was incredible, but I had actually gone about an hour before they closed, so I didn't have time to do a proper like shop with me video. So that kind of dunk um and then i did get and i did try them the cinnamon churros they're only 99 cents and i was thinking like taco bell like it would kind of have that taste i gotta be honest it is like licking a bowl of cinnamon without sugar in it it's like it has a huge not a huge i'm not finding the correct words today it has an aftertaste of pure cinnamon not like a cinnamon sugar you know when you have that yummy buttered toast with cinnamon sugar on it mm -mm. It has pure cinnamon aftertaste. So I probably would never buy these again, but if you like, you know, cinnamon, I love cinnamon, but I can't explain it. It's just too strong, guys. I think that's what I'm trying to tell you. It's just way too strong and it has an aftertaste. So that is my Aldi haul. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And I'm hoping to get into the store so I can do that proper video because... Oh my gosh, God, they had so much stuff. Now, I did get a little bit of dog food. I am not going to show that because people are very, very judgmental on YouTube about your animals. And um, I use dog food. It's the, I actually buy the more expensive individual little packages of dog food, but I, I mix it with vegetables, rice, hamburger, um, but I do use it as a base, or if I'm not feeling well, I will use it to give the dogs, and people are very, 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 very judgmental. So I'm not sharing that. But I spent $65.78. I did take $20 out, that's why it says $20 cash out. But it was $65.78 for all of these items. I think it's really good. I'm going to take back that shade. I wish I knew somebody who could use it, because for $4, I'd rather not bring it back. I'd rather give it away, but I don't really know anyone that could use something that large. So the ice maker's going off. I'm going to hop off here. Thank you so much for watching and I'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.